Hi, I'm Rahul and in this video I would like to talk about some R data science books that would boost your data science learning process. So I know uh, that books are quite boring to read but uh, to know the underlying concepts of uh, different functions and different packages uh, this books definitely help you. Reading books such definitely give you some information how you can use those functions such or packages or different syntaxes or use the code structure to uh, manipulate your data faster and efficiently. So I would like to start with uh, the beginners such a book. Uh, for beginners, I would recommend such this book by uh, Learning R by Richard Cotton, which contains almost uh, uh, every aspect of uh, beginners, uh, those who want to learn the base R concepts like variables, vectors, matrices, arrays, list, loops, packages, and even date times, how you can read the data, clean and transform the data, visualize, and even how to create a package. And once you complete or once you have enough information of the introductory or as base R, you can go for the data science. And for data science, it's one of the best book, I guess, uh, available, written by Harley Wickham and Garrett Wellmound. And that actually discuss about everything, mostly about uh, tidyverse package and uh, data manipulation uh, packages, like data visual visualization with ggplot2, data transformation with dplyr, then importing, then tidying data, st strings such with string r, and date and time manipulation with lubridate and iteration with poor model building and visualization and R markdown. And if you want to go for visualization and want to grasp which more detail about the ggplot2 and want to create more complex plots such as then you should you go for this uh, R graphics cookbook uh, by Winston Chang. It includes such almost everything like bar charts, uh, bar graphs, line graphs, scatter plots, how you can summarize data distribution, uh, digital distribution and annotations, and how you, you can annotate, and how you can uh, manipulate the access labels and legends, and, and you can able to create the facets, which that is another function for creating multiple plots using the subset of the data. And also using colors in uh, plots, uh, how you can uh, manipulate the colors. The next, if you, want to get more details about the ggplot2 then i would recommend to go for the uh, ggplot2 intelligent graphics for data analysis by hadley wickham who is the creator of ggplot2 uh, it would give um, more details of the ggplot2 syntax and how you can uh, get the control over the grammar of graphics like uh, it includes ggplot2 basics and covers every type of plot like uh, mapping of categorical or continuous data, bar plot, scatter plot, line plot, maps, fisting, stats, computations, and plotting, scales, access, legends, everything, whatever you want to, uh, to create a good plot that will, uh, that will visualize your data properly. And if you want to go further for the machine learning application, I would recommend to first uh, probably you go for the neural network that is such a for deep learning and before you get into the deep learning part i would recommend to read this such a book uh, uh, for the neural network concepts that is make your own neural network by tariq rashid which describes all the working principle uh, of the neural nets math behind the neural nets such a functioning gradient descent how it uh, back propagate the weights and uh, minimize the error and it also includes the implementation through python and also uh, includes the calculus chapter so that you uh, get better understanding of the underlying mathematics uh, mathematics to understand how these weights are distributed how back propagation works so after that you can go for the machine learning and for basic machine learning tools like support vector machine tree based classifier or neural networks and ensemble liners like random forest begging boosting clustering like hierarchical clustering k-means model and density based clustering dimension reductions and small amount of big data uh, analysis hadoop is available for in this book there that is such a machine learning with r cookbook by y a y a and chu and after that once you have 
basic knowledge of this uh, machine learning aspects then you can go for more uh, detail uh, deep learning like uh, this book uh, give you more uh, detailed journey uh, of the machine learning concepts it in uh, the book is practical machine learning with h2o by drain cook and it includes uh, the h2o package that is developed by h2o team you can search in the net about the h2o.ai website where you will get the details and it includes data import export and model parameters for classification and regression separate chapter for uh, random forest gradient boosting linear models glm deep learning unsupervised learning also it includes the hyperparameter search that would help uh, uh, you learn uh, the underlying concepts such as how you can apply those for your own data and after that if you need more about such deep learning or neural network concepts such mainly for image classification then i would recommend this book deep learning with r by francis collet with jj lr that includes the fundamental of ml or machine learning working principle of neural nets binary and multi class classification and regression then image classification using keras and keras on top of tensor flow it explains everything in details like uh, how you can implement the cnn or rnn that is convolutional neural network or recurrent neural networks and also discusses how you can optimize the hyperparameter uh, search or grid search that we call grid search so these are the books you can parallelly go through uh, to understand the data science in more uh, detail uh, manner to understand what is going on behind the codes how it works actually i know that uh, this tutorial are pretty good because it's not boring because it is such a pictorial or video based but side by side such reading this books will definitely give you some insights how you can manipulate your data in different way more easiest and more simplest way and this book such definitely gonna help you so thank you